Dallas. That's right. You know what I'm saying? Like Dallas, but set in Washington. Yeah. You should say it just like that. When I pitch it. You should say it just like that. This is fucking great. You should say it just like that. Dallas set in Washington, D.C. You know, with the intrigue and the power plays and the overt natural sex. The glamour, the power. Do you know what I say? It's fucking Dallas. Or, or Falcon Crest. Yes. But it's set in Washington. Say it to Charlie like that. The resistance fighters disguised us as one of them. Charlie. Hey, it's like Dallas, but in Washington. Blue Crystal in the star and roll. Yeah. You tell me when to watch. <laughs> I'll make sure I'm home. You don't think I can make it happen? I don't know anything about how any of that works. I do. You said that you would listen to him. That's why we're here. Do they routinely give starring roles on network programs to people who haven't acted professionally before? She was just on the fucking cover of Playboy, Charlie. Well, I guess that's just the same thing. Would you take this seriously, please? I am taking it seriously, hon, but can you all tell me something? What, what is Dan Rather wearing right now? What? Dan Rather. Well, what is he wearing? You're watching TV. Why well, hadn't he shaved? Well, who gives a damn? Well, excuse me. Hey, excuse me. Could you turn that up? Could you just turn up the volume on the TV? I'm completely high. Yeah. Oh, okay. Still, could you just grab the, the remote there and find the volume button? Charlie, are we going to do business? Dan Rather. He's wearing a turban, Paul. Don't you want to tell him why? He's doing a thing from India. No, from it's Afghanistan. Got it. Got Appreciate it. it. Thank you. The Afghan, the Afghan army. Does he have ammunition for this? He has three, but does he have ammunition? A lot of ammunition. Uh, but, uh, in well, he's Asla talking about the Mujahideen. Priests? No, Mujahideen means like holy warriors. Priests? How the hell am I supposed to know? America seems to be asleep. It doesn't seem to realize that if Afghanistan goes and the Russians go over to the Gulf, that uh, in a very short time it's going to be the turn of the United States as well. I'm sure he knows that in Vietnam. Excuse me. We were just wondering what you do for a living. I'm not a police officer, if that's what you're asking. <laughs> no. We just, we don't meet a lot of guys here who both, you know, know about the world and like to party. No, I'm a member of the U.S. House of Representatives. I'm sorry? I'm a congressman. Are you kidding? <laughs> no, I'm absolutely serious. I'm Charlie Wilson. I represent the Texas Second Congressional Texas. And this is Christopher Lee. This is Paul Brown. What are your names? Stacy. Stacy. Kelly. Kelly. Well, it's nice to meet you both. If you are a congressman, should you be in here with strippers and blow? Hey, um, I'm not a stripper. I am a stripper. I'm a stripper. Yeah, see, they were, they were talking about themselves. You know, you do have a point there. I really should get going. Oh. Little pruny. Look, Charlie, I need $29,000 to make it happen, and you know I can make it happen, and you know you want in on this. Hey, who wants to take a ride with me to the airport? Paul? Okay. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> war against the Soviets. A war, they say, that if they get weapons from us or anyone else in the free world, they will win.